Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. After the visit of French Defense Minister to India, we have heard statement from Sri Rajnath Singh about the ancient development under strategic partnership to power India's fifth generation fighter jet MK. The engine which is going to be developed will have Indian and French technologies. This is expected to drive technology from both Kaveri and M88 engines. Previously, Safran has offered to replace Kaveri engine's core with that of its M88. However, this could not go ahead due to the sharing of critical technology around the core of the engine. However, now the Kaveri score is pretty stable and has issues with its afterburner section. In this video, we'll try to understand whether a derivative of M88 engines will be suitable to power a fifth generation fighter and generate required thrust. The Snegma M88 is a French afterburning turbofan engine developed by Safran Aircraft engines powering the Dassault Rafale fighter jets. They are different variants of M88 engines for different types of fighter jets. The first one is M882 which produces 50 kN of dry thrust and 75 kN with afterburners. Two engines of this variant are currently powering the Rafale fighter jets. Second one is M883 which produces 93 kN of thrust with afterburner. It is developed for a single engine light combat aircraft. Third one is M884 which is under development. It is the higher thrust variant of M88. Once developed, the M884 will be able to produce 95 to 105 kN thrust. As per reports, M884 will be developed by 2023. From what it seems, it is highly likely that France will offer M884 engines to India as its thrust is close to the requirement of AMCA which is 110 kN or more. The fifth generation fighter jets must have following features in their engine. First, it should be stealthy with low observable signature which can only be achieved through proper distribution of heat signatures, usage of ceramic radar absorbent materials for covering the veins of the engine. Second, it should be able to generate high thrust without use of afterburner in order to cruise at supersonic speed and sustain it. Third, it should have world-class thermal management for proper monitoring and managing the thermal signature and overall health of engine. The challenge with French engine is that France does not have a proven fifth generation engine as M884 is still under development. Even the F-35s which are at present the best fifth generation fighter jets have issues with their engine. The fan blades in the engine are developing cracks due to heat leading to frequent replacements of the blades. French collaboration will definitely help India to develop the fifth generation engine. However, the bigger question is can M884 sustain high thrust deployment of the fifth generation? This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.